Hey skiers, I'm Jeff from SkiEssentials.com. I'm here to talk about the K2 Reckoner 92. Uh, super fun ski, very, very affordable. Basically what K2 has done here is they've taken the wider models, the Reckoner 102 in particular, and kind of used that as inspiration for this narrower ski, the Reckoner 92. So not all the same technology, but a lot of very similar concepts. And basically the way that K2 keeps the price down is by just altering the wood core and some of the construction methods. So this ski still uses an aspen veneer wood core. So quality, consistent wood core in this ski. There's no extra carbon or anything like that. And that is basically how K2 achieves that price that's so impressive. Um, we also get more cap construction in this ski. What's interesting, and I think pretty darn commendable to K2 is that they can work this in at this price is there is kind of like very subtle vertical sidewall right underfoot just to boost performance a little bit. But wood core, cap construction, very, very durable ski, um, super fun. You know, it gives it a strong but playful flex pattern that, that Aspen veneer wood core, uh, nice and supple flex pattern there. Um, 92 millimeters underfoot, so pretty wide. You know, I think it's, um, again, impressive that K2 can get a ski in this width range at this price point. So really something to keep in mind and another thing that's very commendable to K2. So 92 underfoot, that's gonna be appropriate on groomers in the terrain park, but also in some softer snow conditions, off trail, off piece scenarios. Uh, really gives it a fun, versatile feel. You can take it just about anywhere. And I think it's really cool that manufacturers are kind of putting a little bit more emphasis and more attention on this style of ski in this price point, because I think there's a lot of skiers that can benefit and really have fun on a ski like this. So 9,200 foot. Um, the other thing that's really cool about the shape of this ski is we get K2's all-terrain rocker profile. So Again, it's just like amazing that we get this technology in skis at this price point. I think it's just a, a nod to how far the industry has come in general. But pretty long tip and tail rocker in this ski, that combined with that waist width gives it more soft snow performance, easier maneuverability in trees and moguls and stuff like that. Also kind of smooths out turn initiation. As you tip the ski on edge, it's gonna help bring you into a turn. Lastly, it kind of gives it a more playful, buttery, smoother feel if you do use it in the terrain park. So that's the Reckoner 92. Um, certainly a fantastic choice for a young park skier, somebody that's going to be bashing it around on jumps and rails and stuff like that. Comes with this Marker Squire 10 binding, so pretty solid binding. It is an integrated binding unlike the, the normal Squire that you would drill onto a flat ski, but still a performance oriented binding. Um, so great in the park, you know, if, if you're kind of new to park or if you're, if you're relatively new to park, this is a really, really good choice. But I think a skier that's never going to step foot in the park could also really enjoy it. When you're shopping in this price point, you see a lot of narrower skis with flatter tails and less rocker. So if you want a ski with just more of a playful, maneuverable feel and overall performance, don't overlook this Reckoner 92. You know, if you look in K2's catalog, they'll kind of point you towards the terrain park for the application for this ski. But I do think it goes beyond that. So don't get too hung up on the, the graphics and the twin tip shape if you're going to be using it as just an all-mountain ski because it works really well for that too. So... That's it, that's the Reckoner 92. Um, you can buy it as just ski and binding, super, super affordable. We also package it with boots and poles. So if you need everything, whether you're refreshing your setup, just like you want new everything, maybe you're transitioning from rentals, you will save a little bit of money overall buying that package with the boot and pole. Um, and we do try and put it with a very appropriate boot they're always going to be more comfort oriented boots. So we know that your foot's not going to be like jammed in there. Um, so, you know, if you want a tighter fitting boot, you can always go to a boot shop. But what we pair with these, we think will work really well for most gears out there. So let us know if you have any questions about this K2 Reckoner 92. 
and we'll see you out there on the slopes.